All right, so can you say in one sentence or less? All right, you know what I mean. Can you say why Donald Trump is the best case scenario for Hillary Clinton? Well, I think for the first time in election history, I think her opponent might donate to her campaign. <laughs> uh, no, no, no. I'm, I'm going to hold you an answer on that. What makes Donald Trump the best case scenario for Hillary Clinton? Now, Jeff, Jeff, I'm not going to let you go to the, back to the airport without giving me an actual answer on this question. What makes Donald Because he's not the best case scenario, John. That's my answer. Yeah, I mean, Donald Trump is a fact-bending loose cannon who alienates mainstream voters with everything he says. But he gets, he gets constant media attention for free. It won't be a day from now until November when Trump isn't on every TV channel. And with a straight face, you're going to tell me that electing a woman is unprecedented? Germany elected a female chancellor. Brazil elected a female president. Denmark, Poland, Korea, Argentina, Norway, Liberia, Cyprus are run by women. So. 22 sovereign states in the world have already beat us on this. All right, all right, okay, fine, fine, fine. Yeah, fine. yeah, I, okay, 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 game change guy. Just in case you accidentally find yourself writing a third book, there's some things that you should know. And, and one of them is there's absolutely no evidence to support the statement that Trump is the best case scenario for Hillary Clinton. 38% of the people gave her a favorable rating. 30% of the people say that she's honest and trustworthy. And just 22% of Democrats say they're enthusiastic about her being the nominee. Sure, she beat Trump in some categories, like millennials who don't even show up to vote. She also leads in the number of messages deleted on her personal email server, but that aside. So when you ask, you ask what makes Trump the best case scenario for Hillary, I don't know what the fuck you're talking about. His tiny hands? <laughs> and we'll be right back.